right what's up what's good what's going on welcome back to the war zone once again we're here to talk a little bit about roly romero professional boxer um just coming off of a uh knockout loss to javante tank davis well roly romero was an excellent excellent judo practitioner man and fighter man and um i'm just wondering why i'm not saying that he's not uh a good fighter and you know i just feel like you know he has a lot to brush up on and a lot more um there's a lot more he can learn in the game of boxing man to become that elite boxer um, but at the same time, I often wonder why did he get away from judo and why did he not think about a career possibly in MMA? Um, having had the judo background, this guy's got power, he's got hands, and he's got the judo. Um, Wow, and I mean, when, when, you, when you're looking at this footage, man, the guy is pretty good. Um, you know, um, because I think that he was kind of late coming in. Um, I think he's behind the curve, man, when it comes to boxing, man. Uh, you know, power can only get you so far. I think he lacks the essential skills, man, to really compete on a high level and be successful on a high level. Yeah, I'm not saying he can't compete on a high level, but um, when you're talking about uh, fighters like Devin Haney and uh, Lomachenko and uh, Tank Davis, we already know, you know, the result of that fight, but I think that he could fight. He could actually compete with uh, Ryan Garcia. I mean, I've seen footage of him um, sparring against Ryan Garcia, piecing Ryan Garcia up. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm just saying that. Um, you know, when you get to that level, man, of competition, man, um, a lot of things just go out the window if you don't have that skill set to fall back on, man. But, uh, but like I said, man, this guy was an excellent, excellent judo fighter, man. I, and um, as you can see, uh, wow. I mean, I don't know what else to say. You know what I'm saying? Um, like I said, I felt like this 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 guy could have had a shot in MMA. I mean, I know that it's it's tough in the MMA as well because most of these guys have been doing it all their lives but I mean he's got a judo background man so you know that that says a lot man with with his um and he's and he's got power and he's got hands too I think wow man I, I mean it'll be a perfect time for him to even you know just think about that at least I'm sure that's not on his plate but um yeah I just wanted to um do this quick video man on this kid's uh background and where he came from before he got into boxing heavy um but like i said man i i just think he needs a lot more work uh when it comes to boxing man uh, but i don't doubt that he has what it you know he can't um improve to the point to where he can compete at that elite level um, cause he's definitely not an A, an A level fighter yet. Um, but if he's really serious about the craft and I mean, from what I hear from him, um, I don't think he's really serious, man. Um, moving forward, uh, like I said, he can win some fights, but you know, when we get to the championship level, man, that's another dimension. Um, but at the same time, man, anyway, man, that's all I really got for you guys, man. Just wanted to make this brief video. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't. Please hit the bell icon for notifications.
peace and blessings to all. And with that, I'm out. Peace.